those guys with blue belts. Dominic also a veteran of LIJJM Challenge Series. That's one of the things about the 10th Planet guys is that they, they want to compete. They want to get into these like challenge match situations. Dominic, got, Dominic got a nice sub on the first one. Yeah. Dominic controlling that leg well. Thomas is from Budokan. Budokan. And another loyal sponsor of ours came up to me and said he's going to offer $100 gift cards from Loyalty Tattoo for fight of the night or sub of the night. Thank you very much, Eric. It's loyalty tattoo. High quality stuff. Thomas with heavy top pressure. And Dominic able to get his knee back inside and replace uh, half guard with a knee shield there. What he wants to do is he wants to keep uh, Thomas's weight off of him. Um, he's using his knees to do that. Thomas is from Lindbrook. I grew up in Freeport, played some football, he's been training for six years, and he was inspired by the Ultimate Fighter on TV. And, um, he's actually had two MMA fights, he's got two MMA fights under his belt. They're putting them back in a kind of kind of similar position. Dominic going for a Gordon Ryan like sweep, but didn't work. Thomas recognized it and just kind of threw him to the side, passed his guard again. Felipe with quick feet, getting that bottle off the mat. <laughs> The energy is great here tonight. We're so love, happy to be here at Royal Jiu Jitsu. Thomas jumping, Ooh. jumping to mount, but then going to the other side for an arm triangle. Oh, very, very good job by Dominic, bro. Made just enough space to create some movement. Now he's wrestling hard here. It's an impressive turn of events. Wrestling, yeah. wrestling hard. Armin Guillotine. Oh, look, this is how Dominic subbed that last guy. The last event, he got that was the sub he got. Yeah, Thomas survived that and got himself, got himself into a good position. Maybe. You can see Thomas looking for that uh, Armin. Uh, Head and arm choke. Yeah. He's going to try and clear the legs and then hop to that uh, to uh, Dominic's left side. Yeah, if he manages to get over Dominic's knee, it's going to be tough. Dominic does a good job. Fishes his arm back underneath. That butterfly is causing problems too for uh, for Thomas. Got <laughs> a young fan in the crowd chanting "Go, Dad." Patrick Donahue, if you're in the house, come on to the table. Thomas locking up uh, Demore on that. I don't know, Americana on that uh, right side, but abandons it quickly. Right about here, I know that Dominic is upset that he can't go for a heel hook, <laughs> but he opts for a straight ankle lock. Thomas putting a lot of weight down. Uh, I'm sure we're almost in the worst guy to mount position. Minute and a 
have to go uh, again. Thomas looking for that uh, head and arm choke. And Thomas got the three points for passing the legs. And four more for getting into this minor position. I had Dominic got out of this before. It's a tough spot, but he did it. Let's see what happens this time. We're going to see Thomas hop over now and try to finish this choke, I think. Again, Dominic doing a good job fishing his arm underneath. Out of trouble, man. You learn all these techniques in the gym, but when you try to do it on somebody, yeah. that's not so happy. Not about so it. easy. It's not so easy. That's one of the first things you learn in jiu-jitsu. <laughs> to mount for, uh, for Thomas. All right. Beautiful job, guys. Beautiful. You guys both represent your academy as well. You really should be proud of yourselves. 